Hey everyone, welcome or welcome back. Um, my brain just left the building, so. <laughs> my name is Tish. <laughs> I can't remember anything, but I did remember my name today, so <laughs> yay me. <laughs> Okay, so today we have a haul. Um, one of the, these things I bought myself um, and the rest my husband bought for me um, without telling me that he was buying them for me. So surprise. Okay, so before I get into what I got, I am not about drama on my channel. Um, I understand some people like Jeffree Star, some people don't. Um, me, I'm one of those people that I kind of already knew he was, you know, of questionable morals. Um, and I mean, it is what it is. However, his uh, makeup formulas do tend to be rather good. Now, <clears throat> having said that they are rather good, they're, his formulas are just not quite as good as a lot of indie brands I have discovered recently. But as far as, you know, mainstream makeup brands go, he does have a good formula for his eyeshadows. Um, I have not tried any of his lips yet. Uh, his liquid lips, his lip bullets or um, lip glosses. I have not tried his highlighters. I have one product from him and that is the Conspiracy Palette. Um, which I like. All right. So when I got into makeup, uh, it was this last December last year. And I, I wanted to figure out how to put makeup on and not look like a two-year-old tried to put makeup on. And so I started watching tutorials and unboxings and I found out about Jeffree Star and of course I got sucked into the whole documentary series with the conspiracy uh, palette and I kind of fell in love with the whole idea of the brand and what the quality of this brand is supposed to be. Now that was around the time that the Valentine's Day box came out and uh, I saw the Alien palette. And then I found out that the Alien palette was to be discontinued. <laughs> so this is all a long-winded way of saying I was very upset that I could not get the Alien palette. I looked on Mercari, I looked on all of these other places and it was really expensive. So then I started looking for dupes and I could not find dupe. Um, I even went to Flawed and Fabulous, uh, her channel, this is Stacy, and she's like the queen of dupes. I'll actually leave her um, channel in the description box below. You should definitely go check her out. Um, if you were looking for dupes, she probably has it or she can probably find it. So I was very excited to be able to get the Alien palette because Stacy didn't have a dupe and uh, I couldn't find a dupe. And of course, that is what the palette looks like. Now I did buy this used from a friend um, and I'm sure that everybody has seen the color story. But the reason I wanted it was because of these greens in here. And uh, this the color story in general just kind of inspired me. Um, so I'm rather excited to get to play with that. Now, with all of the controversy going on, uh, currently with Jeffree Star, Morphe has dropped Jeffree Star. And I was once again faced with another palette I wasn't going to be able to get. And when I was telling my husband about it, I was like, okay, well, oh well, I missed out. I mean, it is what it is. 
And then in the middle of the night, he went and he ordered it for me. And this is the Morphe uh, Jeffree Star palette. And of course, it does have the mirror. And I'm sure a lot of you have already seen this palette. But I am rather excited to get it. I do like Morphe's formula as far as mainstream. Um, makeup companies go. And I also like Jeffrey's formula. So it was kind of a win-win for that. Plus, you know, they have all, all of the stuff on sale. And then he also ordered me the iconic nude set. And that has three glosses and two of the uh, Velour Liquid Lips in Mannequin and Leo. And then he really surprised me when he went and he got me the single Put It Back shade. Which is smarter than me. Haha. -ha. I win. Look at that green. I, for some reason, I have this fascination with greens. I'm not really sure why. I just do. And then he also got me the Are You Filming shade from the Shane Dawson collection. And I love a good red. So that is my Jeffree Star haul. Um, I am excited to play with everything. I'm not really sure about the lip glosses. I will have to kind of test those out and see if I like the formula of them. I'm not a fan of glosses in general. Um, I'm just not a neat, tidy person, and glosses are just extra messy, and I end up with everything in my teeth and in my mouth, and it's gross. So I will have to see if I even like those. If I don't, I'm sure I can find someone to pass them on to. Um, so that won't be an issue. All right, so that is it for today. Uh, if you liked the video, give it a big like comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. Um, all right. I hope every single one of you has an absolutely amazing day and I will see you on the next one. <laughs> Bye.